This demonstration focuses on how TeamCenter Express delivers wide access to a single and secured source of product data, resulting in a decrease in the non-productive time spent searching for data, increased reuse of proven designs, and enables you to improve your responsiveness to your customers' needs. We first log in to TeamCenter Express as a designer. TeamCenter Express delivers a pre-configured CPDM environment including predefined user groups and roles and their associated access privileges. The current logged in user and the group they are a member of are displayed here. The user interface is made up of the navigator panel on the left, the explorer panel in the center, and the data panel on the right. The navigator panel contains several shortcuts that let you quickly select the data you want to work with and the task you want to perform. For example, here is a list of currently open items, and here is the history, a list of the recently accessed items. We now go to the Explorer panel and browse through the folder structure. In this folder, we see an item and an item revision that describe a fabricated dough mixer assembly. We select the item revision and send this to the Relation browser. This application allows you to quickly understand complex data structures. A thumbnail image of the assembly is displayed in the Relation browser. This helps you quickly identify the correct data. When we select the item, the display is expanded to show the data sets that are associated with this item. You can also choose to display this structure in a different orientation. We now select the CAD model for this subassembly and specify that we want to review the check-in, check-out history for this assembly. We can also see that one of the data sets associated with this assembly contains a graphical markup. We open this data set and view the markup. The comprehensive TeamCenter visualization capability that is included with TeamCenter Express is used to perform this operation. We use the visualization commands to zoom in on this model so we can review the markup details. We now use the home shortcut to return to our home area and review some of the other data sets that are associated with this item. For example, this data set is a Microsoft Word document that contains some specification details. Note that the Word document can be opened directly in the viewer panel. The Word document has some images and a stock list that were embedded using the Office integration capability of TeamCenter Express. You can even zoom and rotate this 3D image of a CAD model that was embedded into the document. Now we'll open another data set, in this case an Excel spreadsheet that contains a stock list for the subassembly. Again, this document is open directly in the viewer panel. We now select a data set that contains an AutoCAD drawing of the subassembly. The drawing is opened in the viewer panel. Note that you can access the list of layers for this drawing and turn them on and off, and also zoom and scroll around the drawing. This shows how legacy 2D drawings can be managed alongside 3D CAD models. Now we'll open a solid edge drawing that was created from the 3D CAD model. This is another example of managing multiple file types in a single data structure using the item data structure of TeamCenter Express. Now we'll move on and look at the powerful and flexible search interface in TeamCenter Express. When we first select the search command, a new panel appears that enables searches to be created, stored, and run. We can also get a list of saved searches that we can modify and run. We'll create a new search. First, we select the type of search. In this example, we'll search on the items in the database. The system displays the key attributes for items, but we can expand this list to search on any attribute. In this example, we'll search for all items that have an item name that starts with C-O-N for conveyor. You can see that the search quickly returns the 28 items that meet this search criteria. In order to narrow our search results, we can specify additional filters using some of the search options. For example, whether or not the search is case sensitive and how the search results should be sorted. We can quickly rerun the search to take into account any changes we make to the options. Note that search results are stored and can be retrieved by the user at any time. Now we'll open one of the retrieved items in the viewer panel. 3D CAD models are automatically rendered into the lightweight JT format for better performance when working with the viewer. This enables fast graphical navigation of large assemblies and the ability to visualize assemblies made up of components from several CAD systems. We'll also add this item to our favorites area for quick retrieval in the future. Finally, we save the search and assign a name to the search for future use.
Here's the new search listed in our saved searches. Now we close the search panel and browse to select another item in our folder structure. This item has a Solid Edge dataset associated with it. When we double click this dataset, Solid Edge is automatically started and the assembly model loaded. We open one of the conveyor subassemblies. Note that the Solid Edge Pathfinder in the panel at left displays the status of all parts in this subassembly. This lets us see if other users are working on other components of the assembly. We'll now perform a replace operation for the conveyor belt. Note that in the Replace Parts dialog, we're browsing the database folder for the new part. We also get a preview image of selected parts. This new part is replaced into the subassembly and the file is saved. We'll now return to Team Center Express and open the same subassembly using the Product Structure Editor. This application is a standard part of Team Center Express and enables users to view and manipulate product structures and create BOM reports. Here, we've opened the original revision of the assembly and the new revision. We use the BOM Compare function to highlight the changes that have been made to the product structure. We can also open the viewer panel while using the product structure editor to graphically navigate the product structure. In summary, this short demonstration has shown how Team Center Express delivers easy access to a single source of product data, ensuring that the correct data is used for your design through manufacturing processes.